This love is like the ocean that's crashing over me. It's like falling rain on the driest plains, as far as eyes can see. <laughs> no. <laughs> this is you. You're so beautiful. <laughs> Look, I got you. Put it, on. put it on me, girl. Put it on me, girl. Oh, I got fat fingers. It's hot out. It's You're just hot. You look so good. <laughs> oh, you're so beautiful. You're so beautiful. She called me up and she's like, I found my soulmate. I was like, what? She's like, Ma, I know you think I'm crazy, but I found my soulmate. And then I met him probably like a week later. And she was just in love. His love for Gianna, I knew it was right the very first night that he met her, the next day, he came to me, Mom, I met the girl. I met the right girl. It's one thing to say when you know you know. That moment we met brought an entirely new light to that phrase. Before we met, there wasn't much I was certain of. In fact, I don't think there was anything for that matter. But when our eyes locked, right there and then was the moment I knew everything would be okay. I found you. You gave me peace, you calmed my soul while setting it on fire, and I know you know exactly what I mean. From the day my eyes met yours, I truly understood what my mom meant when she said, when you know, you know. And boy, did I know. I looked at my friend Danielle and asked, who is that? And her response was, it's the man version of you. I then watched you chug someone's brand new forgotten beer in under three seconds and I couldn't help but fall in love. <laughs> I fought back calling my parents that next day and inviting them to the wedding we'd be having. But I chose to be traditional and so did you, starting with moving in together the day after we met, <laughs> me asking you to be my boyfriend on my way to our soccer game where you're meeting my dad for the first time, to becoming engaged in less than a year, and today becoming husband and wife after knowing each other for one year and three and a half months. But like I said, I just knew you were the one. I really enjoy watching them communicate with each other. They are the best of friends, without a doubt. First time I met Keith was at one of our country mega ticket concerts. And I could tell for the first time ever, Cheech was genuinely head over heels for this guy. Gianna has found her soulmate, and thank goodness it's Keith. <laughs> As many of you probably know, it took 17, more like 18 years until I enjoyed Gianna's company. <laughs> Some of that reason is because she was supposed to be my baby brother. Growing up, I hated that she copied everything I did and everything I wore. Never knew that it was a flattering feeling until later on in life. After those 18 years, we became inseparable. Gianna's a fun girl, great personality, and she's just so sweet. Even though when she was a baby, we called her the beast. Oh, she was bad. She was the last of three girls. Her other sister's like, if I did that, but Gianna got away with it, but Gianna was a lot smarter than the other girls. Only because she had them to teach her. Look great. 
<laughs> Hurry up. Don't cry. They've had three beautiful daughters. All three have been married now, and this is the last one, and it's just so great to see them all happy. She's got a good personality, beautiful sense of humor, and uh, but she's the uh, love of my life, and every time I see her, it makes my day. I love my, my great daughter. <laughs> First off, he was our dream come true. He was a miracle baby. He made my husband and I proud from the minute he was born. He was a really good kid. He loved by many. He just, he's got a heart of gold. He gives so much of himself to others. He just amazed us all. He was my best friend, my boy. Turns out he's really a good guy, and I love him. All kidding aside, I think that's uh, the cowboy she was looking for, the best friend she needs, and her soulmate. And I'm glad he's her husband. It don't matter what stormy weather, I love you better than anyone can. He was just so thoughtful in every way from day one. They're both so attentive to each other. They're like the same people. They know exactly what the other one's going to say or the other one's going to feel. And I love seeing that. Because that's what my husband and I have. We're best friends. And I want my son to have his best friend. It don't matter what stormy weather I love you better It's there in the silence It's there in the way you move She said to me, would you be mad if I didn't get married in church? And I said to her, Jay, I said, I always wanted to you too, I said, but if you're happy and this is what you want, it's your day, do what you want. I had to give away my heart today and it was very difficult because he was my miracle. My son was born at 30 weeks and he just has shined every minute of his life. watching his bride come down the aisle. His eyes never left her. He didn't look to see what anybody else was doing. He didn't care. He saw what he wanted to see, and that was a beautiful woman that was gonna become his wife. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my distinct honor to welcome you here today to rejoice with Keith and Gianna on this, their wedding day. Gianna Marie. I vow to always love you more and more as each day passes. I vow to figure out new and exciting ways to show you how romantically, but also keep you laughing. I vow to always nurture our love and always put it above my own needs and wants, even though they're one and the same. I vow to never let you forget just how much you mean to me and to believe in you the way you always believe in me. I vow to never let that feeling subside and to never stop enjoying every second of our ride. I vow to never forget just how lucky I am to get to kiss you good morning and good night every day. One thing that truly sets us apart, G, is how great of friends we've become legitimately the best of friends. I vow to always do the things that make you happy, whether it's Chinese food for dinner seven days a week, or, <laughs> or getting you that late night snack against your will because I know you deserve it. I vow to always be your rock, to be the one constant in this world of uncertainty. I vow to treasure each second by your side, my heart, my soul, my other half, my bestest friend, my future's past. My guardian angel, my partner in crime, I'll have your back for all of time. I vow to never let you forget that I'm the lucky one and you're deserving, to make sure my love is always abrupt and never deserving. I vow to love you, Gianna Marie, forever and always, for better or worse, just like the old days. I love you for all that you are, the romantic side, the happy side, the silly side, the cranky side, the sweet side, the sleepy side, but most importantly, the side of yours that completes mine. You are truly my better half, my soulmate, my best friend, hero, my rock, my partner in crime, my fiance for a few more seconds, and my very soon-to-be husband. 
I cannot wait to spend the rest of my life with you, to create a family with you, and to grow old with you by my side. I vow to you to cherish every moment we have together, to always be understanding, to always be compassionate, to support you in every way I can, to always listen to you and to love you every day, in good times and in bad. I promise to always be your best friend, your shoulder to cry on, your rock to lean on, and your biggest fan. I was yours since about 9 p.m. on May 20th, 2017, and I am devoted to you in every way. I marry you with no hesitation or doubt, and my commitment to you is absolute. There is nothing in this life that I'm sure about except that you are my soulmate and we are two of the very lucky few. I love you, Keith Hilton, and I vow to be your loving wife for as long as we both shall live. I <laughs> love you. Hi, G and Keith. I'm so happy you got everything you wanted today. You guys are just adorable. I love you both more than anything. The happiness you showed everybody today just meant so much. Never lose that. Always reflect on today. I love you both more than ever. And Gianna, love you to the moon and back. Cara Gianna, ti auguro il migliore che un mondo ti può dare. Ti voglio tanto, tanto, tanto bene. E spero che sia felice per tutta la vita. This is the heart. This is the heart of my heart that Gianna has filled for over 25 years with joy and happiness. And I give you this heart because you are the heart that has now filled the heart of my daughter, Gianna. Keith and Gianna, I just want to wish you all the years of happiness. Continuously be each other's friend always be true to each other and at the end of the day make sure you say I love you I'll see you in the morning and start your next day and I wish you both many years of happiness to infinity and beyond welcome to the family Keith love will get you through some of the hardest times in life but it will also bring about many of the best times in life today is one of those best first time moments as Buzz Lightyear says, make sure we always stick together. I wish you to a lifetime of happiness and love as you stick together on this journey we call marriage. If you found the girl of your life, stay with her. Very proud of both of you. I love you both. Enjoy life. I love you guys so much. You guys are going to do well. Gianna and Keith, I don't know really how to put it in words, but you guys are wonderful and I see it in your eyes. I see the love. I see how you guys gaze at each other, how you guys hold hands, and I feel the love. And I could feel it between the two of you, and I am so happy for both of you. May you have many joys and be the light of each other's days. May all that you are always be in love, and may all that is love always be in you. And may you always be each other's best friend and greatest love. I give you this ring. As a sign of my devotion and love. As a sign of my devotion and love. And with all my heart. And with all my heart. I promise to you. I promise to you. All that I am. All that I am. I choose you. I choose you. To be my wife. Be my wife. This day. This day. And forevermore. Forevermore. I give you this ring. As a sign of my devotion and love. As a sign of my devotion and love. And with all my heart. And with all my heart. I promise to you. I promise to you. All that I am. All that I am. I choose you. I choose you to be my husband. To be my husband. This day. This day. And forevermore. Forevermore. I now pronounce you to be husband and wife. Keith, you may kiss your bride.
they usually do something old, something new, something borrowed, something blue. But today I'm going to change it up a bit, and I'm going to do this tradition for Keith. So this time I am going to pass on a few keepsakes for you, Keith. So the first one, this one I call my son-in-law bat. So I pass this on to you. It's old and it's used, but it's never hit a ball. So I want you to hold on to it. It has Mike's name on it, has Eric's name on it, has your name on it too, but with a question mark. So this is for you to hold on to it if I ever have to come over to your house and maybe practice my swing or two. So Keith's feet smelled really bad last night and I made him put his socks out there to air out a little bit. <laughs> and they're still outside. And they're still there. Keep it a little bit lower. Yeah, so we can find it. Is that good? Yeah. Trust me, he'll find Trust it. Trust me, he's gonna, yeah, <laughs> he's gonna find those no matter. <laughs> Not the important stuff. <laughs> Hey, bitch, you're mine. <laughs> no, I have oh, to say that today. Right, hey, right. right, right. <laughs> hey, bitch, he's mine. Not hey, bitch, you're mine. Hey, bitch, you're mine. These are the crutches I borrowed from my friend. So I wanted you to hold on to these, keep them in the house, in case ever me and my friends come over to visit you maybe unexpectedly one night. set of keys. These are to my 1982 Lincoln car. They're blue. So that's something blue. But what was most impressive about that car was the size of its trunk. So I want you to hold on to those keys because I know exactly where that car still is. Good night, 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 Good night,